My name's Nabil Ali, um, I'm a visual artist and I specialise in site specific work to do with organic materials. Um, this current project, the Sea People, is based on the coastal erosion and the effects of climate change on our environment. With this particular project, as you can see, sculptures are behind me and you know, there are many different angles towards this particular project. The um, sea people developed from um, understanding and being aware of coastal erosion and this particular coastline is close to where I am in Essex and this particular project is based on the human figure. When I first came down to the beach I noticed there's a lot of clay stone, London clay, and they look like faces. So when I looked at the stone, they had two eyes, nose, a strange looking mouth, and I wanted to replicate that on a large scale. So what I did, I processed the stones, crushed them down into a pigment, and used a 2000 year old uh, hot wax technique that was used in an ancient, Greek, uh, ancient Greece and um, ancient Egypt. This work, you know, this is the family unit, so you've got the um, the father figure, the mother figure, and the child, which the child in this instance is innocence. And basically this group or family unit has just arrived on the shores of this coastline. So therefore it represents um, the innocence from the child that just wants to play, but the seriousness of what their future holds from their adulthood and what they're going to be doing next from arriving on these shores. Uh, Walton on the Nays, that's where we are today, um, it's evident that a lot of the coastline has fallen into the sea. Um, this is the first time in 27 years that I've revisited this coastline. So well, I have seen a change since I was here last. And um, the Sea People project, it just brings awareness or um, our uh, awareness of coastal erosion also. This project is commissioned by Essex Cultural Diversity Project and supported by Connecticut and Beach of Dreams.